Hey, what's up guys? Today I wanna to show you guys five explosive dumbbell exercises you can do at home to maintain or increase your vertical. Now, a few weeks ago, I made a video on strength and plyometric workouts you can do at home. So if you guys wanna check that out, I'll put the link down below. First off, what do I mean by explosive? Jumping in itself is an explosive movement where the muscles exert maximal effort and force in a short period of time. So when I mean explosive, I'm referring to a movement that emphasizes the rate of force production. Movements like the clean I think embody what an explosive movement is. But since most of us don't have a barbell at this point in time because of the quarantine situation, we need to be creative and find replacements, namely dumbbells. So these five exercises will do just that. But if you have your own gym and already have a barbell at your disposal, you can add these to your routine as an accessory exercise. Now on to the video. With any workout, I like to start with three to five minutes of jump rope and get some dynamic stretches in to get the blood flow going. Honestly, I think everyone should incorporate this to their vertical jump routine because it activates and primes the fast twitch muscles, especially in the calves. I also do some dumbbell squats to activate my lower body before I get into my actual explosive workout. Although this isn't inherently an explosive exercise, I like to emphasize on the speed to focus on the rate of force production. I usually do three sets of 10 to 12. The first explosive dumbbell workout is the jump squat. Now I know I had this exercise in my other videos, but I added this because I thought it was way too important not to add in. With the jump squat, focus on exploding up with the dumbbells and also landing safely. Start out by standing straight shoulder width apart and bend your knees into a squat position. Then explode up by engaging your hips and the overall triple extension movement. When landing, make sure you're not caving your knees and abruptly coming to a stop. You can injure your knees if you don't do it properly. And I do three sets of eight to 12, depending on the weight of the dumbbells. The next dumbbell exercise is the dumbbell swing. If you have a kettlebell, you should use that as the original exercise utilizes the kettlebell, hence the name kettlebell swing. Dumbbell swing or kettlebell swings are one of the great exercises to master a powerful hip extension. A lot of the times people don't know how tight and inactive their hips are, which could be their limiting factor. I found out that this is very true for me as my hips are very tight and sometimes inactive compared to my ankles and knees. So overall, dumbbell swings are a great way to engage your hips, ultimately helping in your other lifts such as the squat, deadlift, and the clean. And I usually do 3 sets of 7 to 10 reps with 20 pound dumbbells and vary depending on the weight of the dumbbell itself. The third dumbbell exercise for explosiveness is the dumbbell clean. Just like the normal clean, this works on the quads, hamstrings, glutes, and the calves, and is also a triple extension movement. The clean is an important exercise when trying to improve your vertical, so I can't stress this enough on how beneficial it is. Instead of using the barbell, I'm using the dumbbell and lifting them over my shoulder just like a normal clean. To do this exercise, stand with your feet shoulder width apart in a partial squat position and drive your heels and explode up as fast as possible while catching the dumbbells on your shoulders as you slowly land in a squat position. Also remember to extend your hips rapidly. This is why earlier we did the dumbbell swings because it will help with the hip extension. Since this is an explosive movement, I like to do 3 sets of 7 to 10 reps depending on the weight. The fourth workout is the dumbbell snatch, which is also similar to the dumbbell clean, but focuses more on increasing the total body power. To do this exercise, just like the clean, get into a shoulder width stance or just a bit wider. With the dumbbell directly below you, squat down so you're in a similar position to a deadlift. Keep your chest and head up high and keep your lumbar region straight. And after you have your position set, extend your hips rapidly, lifting up the dumbbell with your leg and back. The momentum from the extension of your knees and hips should raise the dumbbell above your head. Once you pull the dumbbell into its highest position, catch the dumbbell with your arm, ending in an overhead position. Just like the clean, you catch the dumbbell in a squat position by bringing your body down as the dumbbell goes above your head. This exercise is also demanding on your body, so I do around three sets of five on both sides. Overall, this workout is great for the triple extension. It increases the rate of force development through the posterior chain, ultimately increasing your vertical. Finally, the last workout is the dumbbell jump split squat. It is another great exercise to improve your overall explosiveness and your vertical jump. 
In a split squat standing position, jump and alternate your legs, switching your left leg and right leg forward. This is great for unilateral work on your legs, which can help you improve your one foot vertical and your overall strength and balances. Like always, focus on exploding quickly off your feet and being able to land safely in the right positions. I like to end off this workout with three sets of seven to 10 reps, depending on the weights of the dumbbells for both sides. All right, that's it for the video. Hopefully these five dumbbell exercises can help you get more explosive and improve your vertical during this time in quarantine. If you guys like the video, give this video a thumbs up and sub if you guys want more content like this. All right, thanks guys.